A quote that often reminds me of my childhood is by Lewis Pasteur, and he said, when I approach a child, he inspires me in two sentiments, tenderness for what he is and respect for what he may come. In this speech, I will go through how my past shaped my present and what I've lived through pushes me towards my goals of becoming a lawyer in the future. In this speech, I hope everyone listening can make their own connections of how their past shaped their presence and where they want to go in the future. I will use these three objects. My high school cabin gown, a UCF shirt, and a government book to represent my past, my present, and my future. Starting with my cap and gown, this is symbolizing my past. Up until senior year, I was made honor roll every semester in both AP and STEM classes. Senior year started like any other, and we were back from COVID, and life began to seem normal again. That's until the first week of school my grandmother passed, and a week later my friend committed suicide, and a few months later my other friend died in a boating accident. My grandmother wasn't young, and she lived a full, loving life. I got to say goodbye to her as I cherished every memory dear to my heart. When my friend Ian committed suicide, it didn't seem real. As a week earlier, I was talking to him in the hallway, and he seemed fine. And then a few months later, on Halloween night, when my friend got into a drunk, tragic boat accident, it was the last straw to shatter me. My grades began slipping, and I was working so hard to distract myself. <clears throat> I began missing a lot of school. I wasn't turning in assignments, and as senior activities started, it seemed unfair and selfish that I got to enjoy these activities and do these things while my other two friends couldn't. In this time, I began to do a lot of self-reflecting in my own time and realized me giving up on everything around me was throwing my own life away. And I realized I decided to live for those who I've lost because I would think that they want me to. I graduated and this cap and gown makes me represent those who are no longer here in hopes that I made them proud. After high school, because of my GPA and because of money, I decided to attend community college. I've currently finished up all my general education classes and I have three more electives to take before I transfer to UCF next semester early. I realized to, to take everyone's advice around me and become a pre-law major with a minor in criminal psychology. If it weren't for my past and realizing that I need to live for those who are no longer here rather than stop living, I wouldn't have gone to college and who knows where I'd be right now. This is why this UCF shirt currently represents my future because this is my last semester at Valencia and I'm transferring to UCF. Now, this American government book represents my future of going to law school. Something my parents and I can both agree on is my love and passion of arguing. And although I'm good at arguing, I would also like to go to law school to help those who don't have a voice and to put people away who have done wrong to others. My past has made me realize I want to be a criminal prosecutor. My past has brought me towards every aspect of my future and has allowed me to realize my potential and brought me towards my dreams. Every aspect of my past and present has jerked me towards who I want to be. Grief has knocked me down and built me up for the better. Being in college has shaped me and unlocked a potential I didn't realize I had. And deciding to go to law school has made my inner child happy and made my present self happy. I hope throughout my speech you have made your own realization about trauma, and I want to leave you with this quote by William Cowper to think about. He says, grief is itself a medicine. Thank you.